Well, the Congress has taken votes in support of Israel, several votes after the attack in October by Hamas. But one notable member has been missing those votes. Dean Phillips, Minnesota Democrat, of course, has been campaigning for president here in New Hampshire. We asked him about missing those votes and whether he would have voted to censure his colleague, Representative Rashida Tlaib, over her rhetoric on this issue. Missing votes right now, when we're in the minority, they're not of consequence. I will be in Washington for any vote where my vote matters. Uh, right now, what I think really matters is the future of the country, and that's why I'm here. What about the censure of Representative Tlaib? How would you have voted on that? I told Representative Tlaib that I would not have voted to censure her, uh, that I want to work together. This is a perfect example of how two people with very different backgrounds, very different life experiences, have a responsibility as representatives in the United States of America to still work together. And I think we got to get away from the conduct nation sometimes and start working on invitation. I extended that invitation to her. I think it's important. Do we see this the same way? No. I've not walked in her shoes. She's not walked in mine. But if people like she and I can't sit down and recognize that two things can be true at once, Israelis deserve security and self-determination and protection, and so do Palestinians, then we have failed on day one. That's our generation's time, and, time, and it's time to do it right now. Phillips did return to Washington to vote on the continuing resolution to avert a government shutdown. He's expected back on the New Hampshire campaign trail this week.